Now some breaking news we're still following for you tonight from Woodstock. That's where police are locked in a tense standoff after a home invasion. The Pinpoint News Tracker showing you where this has been happening for nearly 12 hours now on Woodstock Road and County Roads. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Hector Molina is live tonight with the very latest. Hector. Well, Mark, state police and SWAT crews are still here on Woodstock Road after what for what they are calling an active robbery investigation after multiple armed and dangerous suspects broke into a home earlier today. We're called the quiet corner. Today, maybe not so quiet. Don Hibbard's family has lived in Woodstock since 1915. But he never thought he would see SWAT teams converging down the street from his own house. Everybody's got speculation, you know, wondering whether it was a hostage. Uh, There's another boom. So uh, I'm assuming when you hear the, hear the boom like that, it's probably a, a grenade launcher or some sort. State police say a group of individuals with baseball bats broke into a home on Woodstock Road just before noon. State police say a woman was home at the time of the break-in, but she was able to make it out safely. And at this time, police haven't reported any injuries. They were known to be entering the residence with baseball bats. It's not known for certain if they are armed with firearms or not, but every precaution is being taken in that regard nonetheless. They're running. One man who lives nearby sent us this video of what he says captured police chasing someone near the house. I saw two men running in a field and a bunch of cops uh, chasing after them. I heard two gunshots and a, and a bunch of horses being scared off because of it. Nearby homes were evacuated as state police and tactical crews from Massachusetts closed in. All efforts are being made for a peaceful resolution to get the other individuals who are currently believed to be inside the residence to come out peacefully. Now, state police say the suspects are contained to this blocked off vicinity and there's no threat to the general public at this time. However, they're still asking people to avoid this area till further notice. We're live in Woodstock tonight. Hector Molina, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Hector, thank you. Some breaking news just.